All right, so we're checking out the only game where you can effectively recreate Florida by taking 100 old people, shoving them into a house together, and forcing them to woohoo until their hearts give out and they die. It's The Sims 4. Today I will be taking everything I learned in Florida and turning it into one giant experiment that will ruin at least 100 people's lives. This may appear to just be a simple computer, but in actuality, it is going to be the source of evil for all Sims on this lot. So, um, people of consequence have made mods that are very important to me. One of them is a Woohoo mod. The settings on the Woohoo mod are amazing and they are what's going to help us kill 99 people and see who exactly can survive until the end. Because we still have the base mental mod installed, I might throw a bunch of ecstasy in here too because honestly, why the hell not? In case you're wondering, there's a setting here called Extreme Woohoo. When enabled, Sims will woohoo more often. You're goddamn right they will. Oh my god, they've created an actual skill for woohooing. I love that it goes up the more you use it. Practice makes perfect. Allow polygamy. Yes. No strings. <laughs> <laughs> I'm totally keeping jealousy on because it creates fantastic situations that are awkward for Sims, but great for me. Use privacy? When enabled, Sims will shoo other Sims away. Disabled. Okay, now we've created the appropriate environment. I'm gonna have a news crew out here. They're gonna capture this horrifying story as it unfolds. Unfortunately for Spleens the cat, there is no extreme woohooing options for her. I feel like she would be like, I don't need extreme options. My default setting is always on. Tonsils has options, he just can't find them. He's like, it's crazy, I can only see one half of the options. The other half is blocked by something. And as always, Turnip the dog is as far away. Oh, he's drinking from the toilet. He's like, there ain't nothing like high-end toilet water. Okay, first things first. This is a fantastic house, but I need to make it slightly more modified so that all of the sims that we're going to be packing in here have the potential for no strings attached, completely inappropriate amounts of heart-ending woohoo time. Everyone knows what sex candy is in The Sims. It's hot tubs. I don't know why. This one in particular. I love that it's called the birthday hot tub. Since at any point the people woohooing might die, it's gonna be the last birthday they ever had. Look at all the space not being used by the pool. Perfect place for goddamn hot tubs. What the hell is all this stuff over here? Landscaping? Bullshit. <laughs> Galloway, I've got more important stuff to put here. You know what? What the hell? If I can fit him in the driveway, why not? Oh, can fit one over here. Please tell me I can fit this over here somehow. It's like an entire news camera on a dolly. <laughs> yes, perfect. Oh, hold on. I also need a way to memorialize this occasion. If anyone's feeling particularly artsy, they can paint a picture of this horror. Just getting a couple more angles over here. Wouldn't want to leave anyone out. <laughs> Let's be real. What is this fence actually doing? I'll tell you what it's doing. It's getting in the way of more dollies. I decided to put some dance floors here because honestly, why the hell not? All right, we got it all. A distinct lack of privacy, full liquor bars, tons of places to have unprotected woohoo. We're ready to roll. All right, everyone. Yeah, enjoy your time alone for the first few minutes. Once the first 25 Sims come in, everyone's getting aged up to elderly. Turnip is a troublemaker. Really? You're still drinking out of the toilet? He's like, whoa, man, I'm really thirsty. <laughs> Gotta keep this big brain hydrated. I like how these Sims could woohoo anywhere. I've given them countless amounts of woohoo potential, and instead they're watching. I. I don't actually know what the hell they're watching. Oh, never mind. It wasn't that they didn't want to woohoo. It's just that they didn't know how. LSD is over here looking it up on her computer. This feels like an instance where you click on the first link after typing in like how to woohoo and you're like, ah, what have I done? How you doing there, Spleens? Spleens is like loving humans is hard, but eating their plants is easy. As is licking her groin. She's like, don't look at me. It's embarrassing. This is a fantastic pose. This is what I should have put on the merchandise. Ah, uh, I missed one important option here. The autonomous woohoo time. Six hours in between woohoos? I don't think so. All right, boys and girls, nothing's broken. Everything's working. That means it's time to get this show on the road. The first 25 potential woohooers are here. And my God, what a sterling group of human specimens. And in the blink of an eye, Florida is here. I like the two different expressions that happened after the aging up. Florida man is like, pension time, baby. Australian man is like, I, I really don't have anything good to say about this. The only thing I feel is arthritis in my weenus. All right, everyone, congratulations. You now have like limp heart woohooing disease. Start killing one another. Ah, 
The line of death has begun. I like how this lady sat down at the computer I've been using to turn on all the woohoo stuff and she's like, how the hell do you turn it off? Kids and their goddamn computers. Okay, everyone is true lovers now, so they should be, uh, you know, doing completely appropriate YouTube worthy stuff soon. I reduced your woohoo time down to zero. You should all be thanking me. Oh Christ, I just saw Florida man obtain the cooking skill. God no. What the hell are you doing? He's like, I'm trying to burn the goddamn house down. What does it look like? Don't you dare. What? Are you salting the fire? He's not cooking anything. Did you seriously just come over here to knock all my goddamn trash cans over? Well, it was only a matter of time. You, uh, you just gonna leave that there? Yep. How the hell did we already have a no excuse? This guy's like, well, you know, at my age. All right, just getting the fun pills out for everyone. Oh, we got our very first instance. God, it's taking you guys like six hours. What the hell is everyone doing in here? It figures that the very first like one would happen right next to the pill table. <laughs> Damn it, I've got no video equipment on this side. All right, well, the woohoo episode has effectively been christened now. This is where everyone is. They're all friggin' saunaing together. Except for this guy. He's just chilling out in the middle of the steam. Fully clothed. All right, since the first set of Sims finally got this thing underway, I guess we can add 25 more Sims. I have a feeling if I do this, all hell's going to break loose, though. Hello, everyone. Go forth and break woohoo physics. I love how this couple got so close to woohooing and then she fell asleep. What's going on over here? What the hell kind of bathing suit is this? Hey, Sir Richard Simmons called. He wants his workout equipment back. Florida man's over here painting a picture. He's like, ah, this is, this is fine. I'm able to capture the look of disappointment on everyone's face. Turnip is running away, you thankless bastard. Florida man, you're supposed to be painting pictures of people hooing, not pictures of spleens and tonsils. And like a rogue sperm. Oh, now Australian fans are getting in on this. Quickly, someone hop right the cameras. Oh, Jesus Christ, we already had our first death. I don't even think that this guy got to woohoo. There we go. LSD's up in here, making sure to capture all the best <laughs> angles. Yes, fantastic job. Ruin everyone's privacy. Speaking of which, while she was doing that, someone just died. I have no idea where they are though. I know the morning will lead me to their body. There it is. No, our boy that just had fantastic woohoo time. The man with the mohawk. It killed him in the end. I want to call him a loser, but realistically, he's a winner. Not only was he one of the first people to woohoo, but he was also the first person to die from it. Man, Australian man's in on this twice now. He's like the most woohooing person in the whole family. And the fact that it's happening right in front of Florida man made him angry. <laughs> Look at this. The lady Australian man was just with just died of overexertion from her woohooing. You did this Australian man. You're basically a murderer. Death comes in, he's like, wait, Gray's killing people, how? Nope. That's what you get for woohooing off my watch. Okay, we're starting to get a lot more death now. I think I should add the rest of the Sims quickly before there's no one left to woohoo. Oh, there's more woohoo going on right now. And a Florida man's over here painting and he's like, this is how it makes me feel. Who the hell even ended up woohooing? I wasn't even prepared for this. The problem is so many people are woohooing and I, I'm not even invited. It's so Australian man again, what the this painting's really kind of taking a life of its own. Are you, okay, the other lady, that Australian man, just woohooed and it all died just now. God, he's killed two people at the very least. At least that I found. Have a sim outlive five spouses. Yeah, I wonder how. I love that this dude is over here just operating this camera. He's like, just waiting. He's like, go ahead. Someone make my day. Get in the hot tub. Meanwhile, this random lady is like breaking it down over here in front of the MDMA. I love it. There's like a bunch of voyeurs over here that just got in the, the hot tub. This guy is like, I knew it. I knew I could spring someone into action. My God, it took forever. But finally, Florida man is getting it on. Wait a second, are they both like fully clothed inside the hot tub? What the hell is this? Oh, never mind. They just woohooed so hard that their clothes changed. Uh, I just had like seven death sounds happen on my screen at once. Oh God, all the woohooing is starting to catch up to people's old hearts. That's right, you woohoo in spandex, you die in spandex. I'm actually kind of surprised that there's not more dead bodies out by the hot tubs because this is where everyone ends up going to woohoo. Spleens is over here. She's like, yeah, yeah, it's very sad. Is anyone gonna feed me? Meanwhile, Tonsils is like, there's plenty of salty sim water on the ground to drink. The other thing is too, and I never thought about this, because everyone can woohoo, like, 
like and not shoot people out of the bedroom when they do it they all end up getting epically embarrassed and it's killing them all oh my god i can't get rid of the bodies quick enough Stop. i love how these two sims are just like chilling out in front of the hot tub they're like should we do it everyone that's gone in here has died well they're sleeping together technically <laughs> these two did everything together they will hood together and then they die together oh hey someone just died and turn up his back though he may look like he constantly lives in fear he brought us a present it's pretty good it might cheer everyone up because uh all their spouses keep dying from overexertion and embarrassment on the plus side florida man is still alive actually all the original sims are still alive somehow australian man is still alive and he's woohooed more than anyone oh um I guess I missed that dead body just chilling out in the pool. I mean, technically, so did this guy because he's swimming right next to it and like 30 more people just instantaneously died. Oh no. Bab, no. There's literally just bodies in every single room of the entire house that I have to clean. Jesus Christ, someone came all the way up to the third floor just to die. Oh, Australian man, don't you be crying. You know you did this. Yeah, remember that that body that you swam next to in the pool? That's what you get for being an insensitive bastard. Florida man has learned how to stay alive during all this. The answer has been abstinence. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this a woohoo session preparing between Florida man an LSD? It sure is. Someone get on the goddamn boom camera. That's right. Yeah, get a get a close up of this. Perfect. <laughs> Just like that. Oh, they're not the only ones. Look at this is happening over here. It's double wooing. This lady's over here. She's like, God, I hope I have enough film. Florida man. You did this. You killed LSD. How could you? He's like, I still remember when that hoe cheated on me. Vengeance is mine. Ah, decided to go in the pool, did you? Florida man. Christ. You only managed to hit it like one or two times. And he died. Australia man must carry on his legacy. Even Turnip is distraught at this turn of events. Although Turnip always looks distraught. Seriously, Australia man? What are you on? Like three, four at this point? At least it was unsatisfying for him look at this tonsils you got food all around you what else do you need he's like oh i don't know to not have rabies i just want to take a moment to mention that the person that australian man was just with is dead now ah we've got a few others now who are suffering from the pangs of woohooing oh there's like two of them in a row spleens discovered the fire really of all people it's spleens oh god i'm not really sure if this lady died from woohooing or from running from the fire okay australian man is still alive we've got like the last 10 or so sims left and that dude legitimately just fell right into his breakfast i also appreciate that tonsils is still foaming at the mouth i just noticed there's a random ghost chilling out in the house turnip has defeated a wild squirrel in paw to paw combat where what the hell happened did the squirrel like meld into his body this is either the first time whitley ariaga has gotten with a guy or it's just the first time i caught it and there they go there's only like seven people left never mind there's only five people left no he's gonna die with his cowboy hat on how could this happen that's supposed to give you like a plus five against potential overexertion woohoo deaths australian man does your lust no, no bounds. This lady's like, why do I feel like I'm about to die? Whitley, please don't cook. I don't need the house burning down for like the 80th time. Okay, wasn't this the lady that just woohooed with Australian man? What is it about him? He just sucks the soul out of everyone. <laughs> and then there were five. Okay, we've got a brand new couple over here. Considering there's only five people left that an Australian man's videotaping it. He's like, I'll remember this for the end of days. That woman will die by my hand and my woohoo. Where's that guy at? I think the person she was just with ended up dying. Yep, overexertion. Ah, yes. After murdering countless people, Australian man finally needs to take a slight rest. Okay, four people left. This is the best of the best. The wahooers that have managed to prevail against all odds. Okay, these two monsters of wahooing murder are finally going at it together. But who will survive? I like how right afterward, he just fell asleep. Like, they just got done. 
and he's out. I just heard the death music. She's gonna end up dying from this. No, Whitley, you lasted for so long. Australian man claims yet another life. He's like, oh, it wasn't me. This is it, a final pairing between Australian man and whoever the hell that is. I'm not even really sure. I love how these two are doing their thing. Meanwhile, this guy's going over here to paint a sad painting. He's like, every time Australian man kills one of my wives, this is how I feel. It's the most unhappy painting I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Course. After all the sins and atrocities, Australia man finally got what's going to him. Oh, the cats are so sad. Tonsils is like, no. I think the best part about this is that after she killed him, she completely put down his woohooing skills because it was mediocre. She's like, that's what you get for not being good at your job. I love how she's like standing here watching his sleeping body. She's like, can you just wake up so I can kill you? This is it. Finally, it's happening, and thus we will find out who the most powerful sexual monster is in all of The Sims. I'd like to take a moment to also mention that this guy is happy because he's near misery. <laughs> and that is finally it. The instant death from Wuhuing claims yet another soul, and the woman who killed Australian man, the murderer of about a dozen women, is finally the winner. She's like, ah, oh, I couldn't have expected to get this much credit for, you know, having sex with two people. Go ahead and fan myself. I guess I'll leave you with this lovely sad pair, voicing their distress at the entirety of what they just saw this week. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of The Sims 4. Until next time, stay foxy and much love.